What's up guys, Legaia Rossero here and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Legaia. In the last episode, we came here to the, what is it called, the, the Usha's research facility. We talked to Dr. Usha and now we have to talk to his wife so that she can take us to Urumas. So I'm going to try and find his wife so we can go there. And uh, those three mysterious characters that we met a while back. Yeah, they'll have something to do later on in the game. Oh, it looks like I found her. <laughs> oh, it looks like you're all going somewhere. I heard you talking to the doctor through uh, uh, through that speaking tube over there. Now, I may be a little, I may be a worry wart, but I'm a little uneasy about this. Here are some questions to see if you're properly understood everything. Answer all of them correctly, and I give you the ruin key, the ruins key as a prize. Hee <laughs> hee. First question. Now, where is the home of the Suru? Urumais. What are you going to do in Urumais? <laughs> Whoops. Okay, I don't remember some of these questions. Well, such well, such cute adventurers. Of course, I want that key. I need that key. What are we gonna do there? Let's see. What are you going to get in Urmais? The. Fire droplets, because that's what we need. What? Four questions? Oh my god. I forgot I had to take them back here once I get the fire droplets. Shows how much I've been playing this game. I've been busy lately. <laughs> but man, it feels so good to be recording this now. I mean... Throughout the past few weeks, I've not been recording anything of this game. I, I've been busy, you know, just work and shit, trying to have a social life. I, I had just gone back from PAX East 2015. Man, it was a wonderful, wonderful experience there. Um, but, uh, but yeah, that's why. Here's my prize. Yay, we get the ruins key. It's my husband's collectible. It may have some connection to Urumai's. Good luck, I know you'll be able to bring back the fire droplet. Okay, so... Now that we've gotten this key, sorry I burnt. If you guys are disgusted about that, I'm deeply sorry. But, uh... Let's go talk to Dr. Yusha again. He might be able to tell us where it's actually at, the place... My wife has the key to downstairs, blah, blah, blah. Well, are you going to tell me where it's at? I guess not. Because, uh... Now we got to be able to find it. Oh, thank you for telling me. So, it's directly west of where I'm at right now, so... Yay! So all I have to do is just go travel, like, go left, pretty much, from where we're at. Because it said west. So... Holy shit! Wow! Don't fight the queen bees. <laughs> it's not worth it. Oh, the golden book. I forgot I had that. Uh, let me go ahead and... Uh, can I equip it? Of course I'm going to equip it. I need the more gold. I need more gold. I've got no items. No healing items. I suck. Anyways, that is the place we need to go to. Hopefully, I can get there without running into enemies. But I highly doubt it. 
Oh! Awesome! So, we're here at Urumai's. I need to heal. Just in case, you know. We'll, we'll still be able to meet enemies here, but... But yeah. Oh, no shit. Those strange structures in the distance must be... Urumai's ancient ruins, Dr. Yusha said. There's no mist here? I don't know about you, but there is a treasure that I'm going to be getting, which is right there. This is some weird house. Let's go inside. <laughs> what are we going to do with that kid? Sarah? You've been spying on us? So we get healing berries from that chest. We can read this book, I think. There's a book on the desk. Do you wish to read it? Yes. The cover reads, Guidelines for Suru Tap trapping. Suru come out at midnight. A trapper must therefore patrol Urumais only at sunrise. Urumais is off limits from sunset to sunrise because that is when the, f the whispers are frequent. A trapper must never wear a captured Suru. All Suru should be sent to Seoul as soon as they are caught. The whispers are the voices of, the of a demon. Trapper, never listen to the whispers, even in daytime. A trapper must never touch the three doors on the side of Urumai's. So, yeah, even though it explains what we cannot do here, we need to do it anyway. Anyways, let's go ahead. But like I said, there are enemies that we can fight here, if I'm not mistaken. What I like to do is that I like to actually go around the place, search for some treasure. Oh. No enemies, huh? Let's read this tablet here. The faded letters on the sign reads, Warning, Urumasa's soul territory. Do not, uh, do no enter uh, without permission of the emperor. Do no? You mean not? Anyways, let's go over here. Uh, excuse me. Hear a voice. <laughs> Sick. You was key ruins. Who has door dreams will be open. Gather at dream <laughs> door open. <laughs> Oh my god. Anyways, we go to our corresponding areas of the uh, thing. It must be Teague. Alright, so let's go through Noah's path first. Which is this green hallway over here. And then we get the uh, the Genesis tree music. Reason why I call these paths like separate paths for like Noah, Gala, and Vaughn. Because of their color. Uh, because of the color of their um, their roster root that's on their arm. Or should I say this, their, their, their Suru Kai is what I meant. This looks nice, though. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Suddenly, serene words enter Noah's mind. Noah, Noah, Noah and Terra, welcome human, welcome Rasaru. The stone stage awaits you. It awaits your dream. It awaits your mind, Noah. <laughs> she is going to have an important dream. Ah, oh, this song. Damn. I forgot they played this song in this part. Oh, look, it's Noah's parents. And look, there's baby Noah. Jet. Damn. Nothing to worry about. Noah Conkrum's future, your future. Noah, I want you to be, I want you to have a happy, prosperous future. Oh damn, so it all started here. Huh. Courageous soldiers of Soren. Soren. I care nothing of my own life, let the mist take it. After all, I am the queen, I must share the same fate as this nation. But this newly born child, no, I want her to see the future. Please take this child to a land untouched by the mist. Take her to a world with a future, please. Ah, oh, man, my foot hurts. I will take no as far as I can, however far that may be. Damn. <laughs> Aww. Oh no! It's always nice to see like the main character's backstory and why they are, um, and why the events have led up to where they're at now. I always love that in RPGs. Oh shit, so that guy actually died while trying to find Noah far away and that wolf has been taking care of Noah ever since. How do you do Noah? <laughs> I am Tara, I have decided to live with you. Noah, young victim of the whims of fate, the past etched in your mind is now revealed. The pain of your past may have left large scars and may gnaw at your heart, but never lose hope, for when there is hope, you can draw strength from the past. This is what being human is all about, for humans are those who, with hope in their hearts, find the future through the past. That is very true. Damn. <laughs> 
Shinoa has had a rough childhood. Okay, so with each dream that we go through, it'll teleport us outside of the uh, outside of the ruins. So. Let's go to Conquerum after we destroy the floating castle. Something's waiting for me in Conquerum. Someone who knows me. Oh, so the light's already been lit. <laughs> A ray of light from the pillar. So... Of course it's Tigala, but we weren't we aren't able to talk to him yet. We need to actually fulfill these uh things. Yeah, see, it's all broken up and we need to actually go through each and every one of these dreams, so So let's go to Gala's next. I'll do Vaughn last. So, this may be a kind of long episode. Man, Gala, your path is longer than Noah's. <laughs> Okay, so we have just entered through uh, Gala's thing. Serene words enter Gala's mind. So they pretty much say the same thing. Like there's different text for like, like there's the same text for every character, but it'll use their name and their Rasuru, so... Yeah. Gala is snoring. <laughs> wow, Noah. Okay, so we're about to learn about Gala's backstory. Gala must be the strongest in all of Byron, Yuran. He has to be. Songi can train all he wants, but he can never match Gala's spiritual strength. Silence, it's Master Zapu. Eight years have passed since the mist covered the earth. These are difficult times, but I am pleased at how hard each of you are, is devoting yourself to your training. Now, as you all know, tomorrow is... Biron's Transmi Transmigration Festival. As always, we will hold a ritual tournament. Gala. Yes, Master Zapu. Songi. Yes, Master Zapu. As monks of Biron, these are things expected of you. You must fight with all your strength in order to make a sh to in order to make this a chivalrous tournament. Wow. <laughs> I don't like the look in your eye. Talking about wanting to have a good time. <laughs> But Songi, tomorrow's the tournament. Are you sure, Jiggle Grass? Huh. 
Wow, Sungi. So he figured it out. <laughs> He took some fury fury boosts. Wow, dude, that's messed up. That is messed up, Songi. Wow. Oh, this song again. She nearly killed him, you faggot. You think you're clever, don't you? You think you let me win. You're so arrogant. You think it's funny to make a fool of me like that. Some best friend, hypocrite. You gave him... Jigo grass, you numbed his body. It was your fucking fault. <laughs> Gala, you did your best. You have nothing to be ashamed of. After all, even when unavoidable misfortune occurs, it is the spirit that remains in the end. So be proud of yourself and use that pride to create happiness. This is what it means to be human, for humans are... For humans are those who create their own happiness with their pride. Huh. <laughs> the words echo in Gaul's mind. Okay, so we are being transported out again. <laughs> Golly, you seem sad. In my dream, I remember some I didn't want to. It's okay, Gala. We all, all we all dream of something that we don't want to remember. But then again, it's part of life. So that light is called the phantasmal light. It activated. It's activated by your dreams. Phantasmal light. Got on, Gala, that's neat. This is fun. Well, if you talk, if talking is that disagreeable to you, do what you must, but listen to Ozma. If your intentions ever diverge from mine, then believe me, I won't get away with it. You won't get away with it. <laughs> yeah, we need to see Vaughn's dream.
But unfortunately, guys, that'll all have to happen in the next episode. So, yeah, with that being said, it's Legaya Rossi signing out. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And as always, stay gaming. See you later.